welcome back this is going to be your libra reading all that i need to know about your person your situation for the month of april so yeah let's begin starting with how does your person truly feel about you your connection so we start off with the devil in the reverse at the moment i believe this person wants to face you they are not quite wanting to run away from their fears not quite uh, so focused on their addiction issues they want to quite stay open to falling in love with you this person feels ready to break free from what was holding them back that could be past baggage they are finally ready to let that go for good if they were stuck in some negative behavioral pattern or some addiction issue they have worked hard to release themselves from it okay you can expect a big change in terms of their overall energy and feelings we have the queen of wands this person loves you and admires you very deeply and they love how confident you are at the moment they are quite manifesting you in their life they love being with you and they are excited to see where this relationship goes uh, they feel a very sensual and a deep attraction to you if it's a past person they think of you as their queen or their king and they are attracted to you in a way that they haven't really experienced before if you're asking about reconciliation it's a big yes so we start off with the knight of wands so their overall energy and effort will be to come forward have this uh, joyous relationship with you look forward to it also with the nine of pentacles at the moment this person is wanting to show their confident side to you they want to put in that effort they want to let you know that they are finally ready for this and moving on to outcome with the temperance card i do believe for most of you you guys will be on equal terms with each other you guys will be on the same page okay so that is the collective energy now moving on to the past what really went wrong in the past past we are getting the king of swords this person was thinking more practically they did not really want to give their heart a chance they were very much fully focused on making practical insensitive decisions okay in terms of how do they see you now they feel like you will not take any step forward they feel like you have finally realized your worth and they do not see you chasing anymore clarifying this further let's see why do we have the hanged man as how do they see you now you see the seven of cups they also believe that you are waiting for better opportunities or better options with the eight of swords uh, they feel you're so fearful of things going round in circles that you won't risk coming back to their life or looking forward to them you will only be open if they're coming back with a serious offer and with the eight of wands uh in terms of how they see you they feel like you're waiting for truth and clarity they feel like you're waiting for fast changes communication and for, for them to make that decision once and for all about this relationship they see you as a bit exhausted and frustrated with them and as someone who wants them to surrender to this relationship past energy this person could have taken forever to make that decision based on this connection this relationship in terms of action I do not feel this person took any major action besides a message or a some bit of communication here and there this person was still silent they were not quite trusting their intuition or not quite trusting their own feelings moreover they were running away from their responsibilities but with the sun card right now since it's called upon i think this person will finally be open to accepting that you genuinely make them happy and you are someone that they want to look forward to so you guys can expect a lot of attention with the sun cardio also things that they were hiding previously will be coming to light future action we have the king of pentacles this person wants to finally take a stand for this relationship they want something stable they definitely want to focus on stability and reliability and being a steady presence in your life and they want to show you that they can provide a secure and a comfortable life for you they want to uh, provide emotional support mutual understanding and they want to take care of uh, all the responsibilities okay they want to show you uh, they are a uh, very mature side this time overall they are focusing on building a strong relationship with you also with the justice card this person wants to approach this relationship with fairness and honesty they want to focus on balance uh, majorly on give and take also focusing on clear communication and mutual respect and the equal exchange of love and care 
they want to be honest about their feelings expectation intention past and majorly working forward to have a good relationship a honest uh, relationship with you a balanced relationship with you do type in 10 10 for stability and growth in this relationship and like the video in terms of justice being in the past with six of swords this person was just not ready to face challenges and be upfront about their feelings and intentions with the six of swords this person was just not ready to get into anything intense with you or anything committed with you they wanted to have their cake and eat it too for the queen of cups i do believe now this person will want to open up their heart space which previously was blocked and finally we have 10 of wands i i believe this person wasn't quite ready to see where this like relationship was going they were rather happy with what they had with you they were not quite focused on the long term outcome also they were not quite want to take responsibility of holding this together but this time with the 10 of wands they will see to it that they give it a genuine chance they genuinely be open to you in terms of their heart space in terms of their emotions how do they want you now with the star card they want you as their other half their soulmate uh their life partner they are focusing on re renewing the connection renewing your hope yearning for a healing and a harmonious relationship with you they are also quite longing for a balanced connection hoping for a brighter future together they also desire for a more spiritually emotionally fulfilling connection if it's a past person they are hoping for a reconciliation and seeking healing from the past hurt majorly focused on healing and reconnection with eight of swords there was a lack of mutual understanding and unwillingness to learn from their past mistakes there was also lack of logic and reason in this relationship which added to the drama with the nine of wands your your person is in their feelings right now your person could be feeling very weary and beaten down from past experiences even you could be feeling that but they are quite determined quite uh, focused on making things work ready to fight for your relationship and your person could very much be fighting their inner demons such as tendency of being unfaithful sometimes okay uh, they are very much focused on their healing they are extremely determined to fight their bad habits for the relationship's survival secondly with the devil card if at all they were quite letting some toxic attachment get in the way say suppose it's a past person friend circle wrong company then they are willing to let go of that baggage in order to be more available for you and with the page of swords if in the past they were playing it too safe where they were extremely defensive never wanting to give you any clarity never wanting to uh, probably tell you as to what's bothering them then this time they will take the chance in order to make you understand their part of the story as well in terms of the 8 of swords here with the 8 of swords i do believe this person has major anxiety when it comes to commitment or uh, they are not are not just ready for it for some reason maybe they've had some past bad experience with 3 of pentacles they still feel like they need to work more on their finances or or, or they need to be more uh, ready for it or they need to put in more effort in their life and finally with the five of wands their fears their doubts uh, their lack of self belief blocks them also they do not have the best of friends which can guide them to move forward rather their friends manipulate them against you so far if this has resonated please take a moment to like the video and subscribe to the channel also comment 555 to manifest changes in your life now moving on to your person's current feelings heart space and head space starting with past feelings with the 9 of pentacles it typically represents uh, this person wanted to be more self sufficient independent focused on their luxury feeling secure and content on their own however with the 6 of pentacles being the current feelings they are focused on being generous and wanting to give back reciprocate your feelings and emotionally support you they are quite looking for a balanced give and take relationship with you now they'll focus more on giving this time so you can expect a lot of attention if at all their work kept them busy then this time they will want to focus on keeping that balance as well between their work life and their romantic life in terms of their heart space heart space with the wheel of fortune this person has had issues 
with believing their own feelings sometimes they have intense feelings for you some days they feel like they do not have much emotional connect rather it could be like a practically suitable option sometimes they feel like it is more uh, on the sexual side where they feel very attracted to you but around this time they are feeling like you and them were meant to cross paths that you and them were supposed to have something solid okay in terms of their head space head space they have already you know accepted you as their soulmate as their other half as their suitable partner as someone who is going to share this life with them okay that being said let's clarify things further we have the emperor card so this person definitely wants to take a stand for you now in terms of like what they can do different to have this relationship in a better way they'll be more responsible they'll uh, definitely like want to take full responsibility of the connection with the magician card they are trying to manifest like they are trying to make things right uh, they definitely want to give you an idea of what you could look forward to and finally with the moon card they'll majorly work on being emotionally available okay this person has issues with uh, being uh, like vulnerable or being emotionally open and that is a major area uh, where they need to focus on and that is exactly where they will focus on even if they are not able to fully be open they at least give it a shot okay so i won't give you high hopes but there there'll be constant efforts being shown from their side which you are going to take well okay in terms of the 9 of pentacles here why do we have the 9 of pentacles with the 8 of cups this person is not a very emotionally available person like they are someone who you like usually chooses a practical suitable option emotionally they they choose to stay distant okay with seven of wands uh, they are not someone who would be very much invested in the connection rather they like to have it their own way their love language will, will be mostly like giving someone the time and attention your love language will be mostly staying emotionally available right and with the fool card what's going to change this time the outcome i see this person taking their chance towards you but mind you there will be certain times or certain days where this person still chooses to stay a bit distant they'll be available they'll be there but they can still be silent okay so please be careful if that is happening that is because this person isn't used to it okay and you will have to be little understanding a little patient with it moving forward in terms of their major intentions towards you now major intention is to come in quick major intention is to have your full attention they are intending to quickly move this relationship forward okay they want to make this relationship work no matter the consequences and they will cr cross any boundary and uh, they are willing to go through any sort of consequence um, they are so determined that they want this to move forward they intend to be in a relationship with you around this time and not just for the sake of it but for the long term reasons for a lifetime reason they are definitely looking forward to have a deep harmonious romantic connection with you it represents a union based on love compatibility and shared values and they see a potential in a long term happiness and fulfilling relationship with you see i feel if at all like there were differences like which were earlier getting in the way with the queen of pentacles like they were non committal or they were very hurtful or they were unnecessarily rude to you that is about to change the way they see your relationship is about to change okay with queen of wands they'll be more available towards wanting something solid okay or they'll be more open or flexible towards the idea of a committed relationship if previously they discarded it or previously they were pushing you away then that is about to change okay with 10 of uh, swords if at all this person's fears or blockages or past was quite not letting them be open to you then they are pushing that aside and wanting wanting to take their shot towards you okay clarifying it further with the four of wands in the reverse they wanted to have whatever they can get from you and get away with it but this time that is changing okay in terms of action we have the ace of pentacles which tells me this person is super serious about offering you something stable something tangible something that you could look forward to something that you could believe in something that you um, you know feel like is a genuine offer okay 
and mostly i feel with the death and rebirth that's a death card by the way things are about to change quick in your life okay when you least expect it this person will just show up and want to fix things for good but this can take a good 10 days in the making okay where this person is showing in consistent effort like, uh, like coming forward in a very honest uh, like manner okay that being said why do they want you back why are they wanting this relationship they want you because they love you they have realized it they know that what they share with you is something that they cannot easily find elsewhere in terms of what's blocking them from coming forward or what was rather blocking them from coming forward you know they wanted to play it safe they wanted to keep themselves guarded they want you were dealing with someone who's insecure someone who's bit uh clingy sometimes uh, they are scared of losing you but they were also very scared of being vulnerable or they were scared of being emotionally available they were still holding on to past hurt past pain and projecting that onto this relationship now moving on to your energy feelings and intentions i don't think you are very much um showing any signs or you are holding back the best way you can you're very focused on your healing in terms of your major feelings right now I mean, you would definitely want to talk to them. You want to have some bit of conversation. You want to have some bit of clarity. You look forward to what they could say or what they could do next in terms of your intentions. Your intention is for this person to give you the clarity so that you could either look forward to it or you could look forward to someone else. Okay, so your intention is to stay open to the choice that might come in next. Okay, if at all... What do you want from this connection? Like what you want from this person is for them to be clear, for them to be upfront, for them to be honest and for them to uh, definitely give you an idea as to what you can expect next. Okay. In terms of your feelings. With Ten of Swords, this person has definitely affected you mentally, if not physically. With the Tower card, uh, definitely you've been waiting on big changes uh, you have also healed a lot you know being a part of the situation you've definitely changed for the better with the tower card what you expect is some major changes and uh, like what you want is success and clarity in this relationship i don't think you're you're moving on from them or you're dropping them but you're showing them as if you're not interested you're showing them as if you're not going to wait forever but what is really going on is you want that clarity. The moment you get clarity, you will open up yourself. Okay. So what you could look forward to in the next, let's take 15 days. With Ace of Swords, you guys will be definitely having that conversation. You guys will be face to face with each other. With Page of Pentacles, this person will definitely message you or reach out to you. That is for certain. And with Seven of Pentacles, this person will stay invested. They will not just come and leave. Rather, they will stay invested. In terms of where this relationship is going next. With the world in the reverse, this relationship isn't over. Okay. With Nine of Wands, in terms of action, this person does not want to give up on you. And final outcome, we say Three of Cups. This person will choose you and probably stay open to you for a long term. Overall, you guys will be having a good time. Uh, this will be a harmonious relationship. Both you and your person uh, will value peace, harmony and balance in this relationship. And they'll be getting along well with your friends and family. You, you guys might also be planning a trip soon. And they will very much want to adapt and compromise to your social circles and ways of going about life. So yes, in terms of collective feelings right now, what's really going on? Collective feelings, I'm getting three of pentacles. So you both want this. Even if you guys are denying it or not quite wanting to believe it, you guys both want this in terms of collective intentions. Intention is for um, them to give you the clarity and that um, happiness that you deserve. Okay, you really want this person to finally open up or to really treat you like a partner is to finally accept you like a partner is to finally accept this relationship like a genuine relationship and collective outcome i feel you guys can expect a lot of changes we have the death and the tower 
okay i feel most of you guys are in this space if at all you can't have it you will drop it okay so that's what i see with three of swords uh, if at all this person had some past person uh, which was getting in the way that is going to be clear that is going away message and advice message and advice with four of cups darling just focus on yourself there is no reason for you to panic okay and advice advice i i would uh, just ask you to be open to what this person has to offer because it is definitely a real offer they are not messing up with you okay now moving on to oracle cards some of you who are in extremely toxic connections will be face to face with reality and there's a good chance you will end it for good if at all it's toxic and you know it's something that you need to get away from okay so yes we have jealousy i feel like you've moved on without me and that's difficult for me to see this person definitely believes that you're not on the same page as them they know that you have finally uh, been keeping yourself open to new possibilities new outcome we also have why i don't know what happened between us uh, but i was very confused and now i am wanting you back in my life following following we have energy you've been thinking about me because i've been thinking about you we are connecting and final card we have is respect you deserve the best and i respect you i want to do the right thing that is what i spoke about they want to do you right this time with the king of swords they want to bring in the clarity they want to bring in the closure that is necessary for this connection to go ahead okay that being said let's move on to messages okay in terms of your person's messages just listen to this as if your person is saying it out loud to you i feel like a failure is in the past you make me nervous also in the past energy in terms of present energy we have i pray about us all the time we also have i watch your social media every day we also have you are the best person in my life i can't picture my life without you no one can get in the way of what i feel for you and finally we have is i want to show you how much i value you so that is what i feel uh, we have with the uh, knight of cups and the king of cups this person does want to show you how valuable you are to them how much uh, they want to you know look forward to this and if at all they've done something wrong in the past they will definitely want to apologize for it okay on that note please do like this video and comment 555 to manifest changes or you could definitely comment 777 for clarity so libra if you are dealing with an air sign let's see what's happening overall energy right now the sun card truth and clarity will definitely be out if at all this person was hiding something or even you were hiding something i think you guys will have that conversation you can definitely look forward to it i also see this relationship moving towards happiness you can definitely type in 1111 in terms of their major feelings at the moment this person feels left out in the cold by you they are not happy no matter how many options they have they will not choose anything else besides you okay all they want is you in terms of intentions intention i still feel since uh, they were very rude to you or they were just not available to you in the past or the misunderstanding that you guys could have had in the past or uh, that back and forth uh, you know wanting to prove a point that has caused a lot of damage in this connection you both were wanting to win the battle you both were wanting to win the war they were wanting to prove to you that they are right you wanted to prove to them that you are right so that led to a lot of drama but with the knight of wands this person will always come back to you if at all this person is distant uh, they were waiting to see whether you will reach out or not and if you haven't in the past 5 days 5 weeks if some of you even 5 months for that matter this person is going to approach you okay and it could be very flirty and you're going to be like oh my god you're just behaving like nothing ever happened in the past okay that being said the first message i have is respect you deserve the best and i respect you i want to do the right thing if at all this person was foolish and using a lot of mind games in the past then this time they see their faults okay do like the video before leaving and subscribe to the channel libras who are dealing with water sign pisces cancer scorpio let's see what's happening so this relationship has gone through the best times the worst times right now the cycle is changing to a better time 
in terms of your person's energy and feelings this person looks forward to you they are optimistic about having a chance with you or looking forward to a chance with you they still admire you they still are very much uh, wanting this in terms of intentions intention with the nine of pentacles the problem however is this person is not very good with having to express themselves they always want to keep themselves safe if at all they are coming forward they will still want to play it safe they will not want to fully take the risk of coming forward expressing and then losing you know so i feel they will want to tap onto your energy if they feel safe they will want to look forward to it if not they will hold back easy as that and this person was more focused on their finances than their love life we also have five of swords and the knight of swords after holding back and forth this person will finally feel like a loser for losing an opportunity with you if at all they are distant and away from you and you're not giving in then this person looks forward i feel for some of you haven't been in communication since feb if at all that's the case you guys might receive that message out of nowhere in the first week of april in terms of message we have understanding i see your side of the story you could type in 222 for togetherness and changes also like the video and subscribe to the channel thank you so much moving to libra is dealing with fire sign aries leo sagittarius what's happening overall energy this person still looks forward to you they are uh, very positive and optimistic on the fact that this can still work out in the past they could be struggling in terms of how they need to approach you feelings what do we see feelings with the queen of swords this person is not a very emotionally available person they are rather someone who would give you time and that is their love language their time is their love language and they are very rude sometimes with their words they would give you such petty excuses which might trigger you okay in terms of intentions but they do like you a lot Okay, and they also feel like this connection is something that they want to carry forward. However, with Seven of Swords, this person is someone who doesn't deal with pressure well. So in the past, if there were situations uh, which demanded them to take a stand, uh, you know, uh, for this relationship, they could have rather stayed away or, or run away from it. But this time, they definitely want to take their chances. They do not want to lose this opportunity. They want to look forward to this connection in a very optimistic, positive way. So they will take uh, their chances, that risk, in order to step up. Okay, and final outcome. Final outcome, we have King of Pentacles. The problem is this connection never really goes anywhere. It keeps coming back. Okay. On that note, we have forgiveness. I'm struggling to get over the past. It doesn't have to be a past person. It can just be a past situation that they were a part of. And we have missed opportunity. I didn't act when I should have. That is the reason why they're coming forward again to revive the relationship. On that note, you could type in 444 for stability and growth in this relationship. To like the video before leaving. Thank you so much. So Libra is dealing with Earth sign. Let's see what's coming up. Overall energy, please. Overall, with the Emperor card, this person wants to take a stand for this relationship now. They want to take responsibility. They want to come forward with a lot mature and a very practical approach. Okay, past card we have is the Empress card. This person hasn't given up on you, even if sometimes it feels like that. In terms of their major feelings. Feelings with the Page of Swords, the problem, however, is this person has a lot of trust issues. And that always gets in the way. If they are one step in, they are also one step out. In terms of their intentions. The problem however is that they are not healed. It is not your issue. It is them. They need to get over their fears. They need to get over their problems or, or their pain. In order to be more available for you. I feel this relationship throughout April will be on and off. But they will keep coming back to you. So I do not see that being an issue. Howsoever this person struggles with having to emotionally stay open to someone okay reason being they they are going through depression clear and simple okay sexual this person will stay open but emotionally it's going to be a challenge for them so on that note you could type in 777 for clarity i still believe they need to heal from their past in order to be more available for you we have energy you've been thinking about me because i've been thinking about you so that's all i have for you do not forget to hit the like button all of you who are struggling with your personal relationship and would need further guidance can definitely consider a personal reading i will 
definitely help you understand your situation better bring in clarity and guide you further as to how to move forward with it